What's going on guys? I'm Jada Black. Shout out to everybody that's tuning in. I want to talk about this uh, Michael Jordan, Mary J. Blige interaction that went viral. Apparently Michael was having a little bit of a good, too much of a good time while he was at the NBA All-Star game. And he was chatting up people. He was hugging people. But when it got to Mary J., you know, he was really hugging up on her, you know, and <laughs> to the point of grabbing you know them assets because you know mary j had them out you know what i'm saying she she's very curvy and she was looking her best and you know michael had to go over there and reintroduce himself <laughs> and they have this interaction man it goes viral as you see this picture here this is this is what people are talking about uh, Mike was in a very good mood, okay? Mike was in his element. He was at the NBA All-Star Game. He was there with other NBA legends. And I just think Michael was just, he was in his element. You know, Mike likes to be the, sort of like the chief or the alpha in the, in the, in the room. That's who my, Michael's always been. So him, you know, being a bit handsy with Mary Jake, but y'all got to understand, they probably have a previous relationship as far as they known each other they've been around each other they could they may have you know gotten personal with each other back in the day so we don't know the depth of their listen mary j is single <laughs> okay she ain't with nobody all you do is you see when you see mary j for the most part she's always with a bunch of dudes y'all have y'all noticed that every time you see mary j she's with a bunch of guys all right so she just out doing, you know, doing her, you know, I don't know what Michael's situation. I know he's married, but again, uh, he, he was there. He was, he was in a very good mood. You know, he was there to have a good time. He was in Cleveland to have a good time. Let's get to this bro Bible article. The new images have surfaced of Michael Jordan getting a little handsy with Mary J. Blige at the NBA all-star game. As a result, NBA fans, having a lot of fun with the pictures and videos of his airness. NBA legend Michael Jordan made a surprise appearance at the All-Star Game Sunday night after watching his NASCAR driver Bubba Watson finish second in Daytona 500. Jordan was on hand as part of NBA's 75th anniversary team celebra uh, celebration during halftime of the game, drawing cheers from the fans even louder than that of hometown boy LeBron James. But I thought, you know, the you know the opposing players get booed. <laughs> you know, but they cheered Michael Jordan. Because, you know, Mike never played that. But anyway. And while things may have gotten a little awkward when his airness and his frenemy, Charles Barkley, crossed paths Sunday night, there was no such issue when MJ ran into another old friend, Mary J. Blige. Blige, fresh off her performance with Dr. Dre, Eminem, 50 Cent, Kendrick Lamar, and Snoop Dogg at the Super Bowl halftime show, received congratulations from the Chicago, uh, Chicago, the Charlotte Hornets owner for a job well done. Jordan has expressed his admiration for Mary J with a hug and a little pat on the behind. Now, this is the interaction here. You can play it. Okay, let's see. <laughs> listen I, listen um you could just say you could just say well you know maybe that's just mj you know maybe you know he doesn't know you know where his hand is and where her assets in so it could be it listen do i think jordan was trying to get a feel on maybe maybe because again jordan was hugging everybody jo jordan was in a good mood okay jordan was there to party <laughs> and jordan when he saw Mary J. Blige, he was going to make an effort to go and say something to her. He was going to make an effort to go over there and say something to her. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Look at LeBron in the background. Look at LeBron in the background. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Listen, man. Again, they are acquaintances. We don't know how personal this friendship or, you know how close they've been we don't know that man listen 
I haven't I don't see I haven't seen Jordan hug other other women so I can't judge his hand placement but this is what has gotten people talking his hand placement you know but that could just be Jordan who knows you know he's running up hugging dudes I mean that's just that's what Jordan was doing so fun fact Michael Jordan appeared in Mary J Blige's video give me you while yes patting someone on the rear is a staple of all athletes, fans couldn't help but also notice that when Jordan, Vanessa Bryant, and Blige posted a photo together at the game, MJ Hands was still wondering a bit. Not that she seemed to mind sharing a photo on her Instagram because he's Michael Jordan and she doesn't care. You see, guys like Michael Jordan will always have the opportunity to get close and do things with women because those women allow it. This ain't a situation where Jordan was going too far. She didn't care. Now, there was a, also a video, I want to have it, of this interaction with Tyrese. Now, Tyrese, Tyrese was trying to grab at her thigh. Watch her hand. Uh uh, uh, uh. <laughs> now, again, during this time, she was married and she may not have thought it was appropriate. But I mean, this this video too also went kind of viral because it's almost like she was curving Tyrese in a sense, you know, curving him. So if people say, well, she was married at the time. That's why. But, you know, I, listen, if, if Michael Jordan had, you know, hugged her the same way, even if she wasn't married, I don't think she would have mind either. That's just because I saw I saw some conversation with people like, well, because of who Michael Jordan is, he's going to get a pass from women. And that's true. See, when you're a guy like Jordan, women will let you grab them wherever with their permission, of course, with their consent. But some of you other guys, because you're not a Michael Jordan, you ain't going to get that same opportunity. That's just how it is, man. That's just how it is. 59-year-old um, Jordan is currently married to model Yvette Pareto. Blige is currently single after divorced her husband of almost 15 years in 2018. Naturally, NBA fans cannot let something like this slide, even if it was just friendly, innocent gesture without offering up some internet trademark commentary. So I just showed y'all video. Michael Jordan watching Mary J. Blige last week at the Super Bowl halftime show. The last dancery. Mike was this getting off the plane from Daytona 500. <laughs> My, my man said this. See if y'all can hear this. I'm like, I'm leaving here with something. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm from around the way. I'm leaving with something. I'm like, <laughs> y'all don't remember the rumors from the 90s that real love was about Michael Jordan? As tall as he is, how was his hand, how his hand get all the way down there? Oh, trust me, it can get there. He was on demon time. MJ wasn't the only one that saw that ad. Maybe not. I mean, listen, she was, you know, she was catching some eyeballs. You know what I'm saying? Listen, I've never not said that, you know, Mary J has not been able to, you know, keep a body on her. You know, you look at some of the photos that she has. She definitely has the assets, the yams, as they would say. That's, that that's you know may have caught some eyes and it definitely may have caught Michael Jordan's eyes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Braun was stalking MJ the whole night. Jesus. Well, again, people have their thoughts on this. You know, to me, I, I don't think it's that big of a deal. Um, I don't think that Mary J was upset. I don't think Mary J was feeling some type of way because again, we don't know how deep you know, their uh, friendship goes. And people are saying that one of her songs may have been about Michael Jordan. Because Michael Jordan was, even though he was married back in the day, I think that Michael used to get it in allegedly. And I'm pretty sure there's a ton of women that have wanted to be with Michael, that Michael's been with. Mary J was probably one of those women. Uh, you know, he, the Mary J is one of those women. But people are making this out to be as if he's getting handsy and why is he grabbing on her assets like that um she let him do that because 
they may have a deep connection that none of us know people have that you can you could have let's say you had relations with somebody 10 15 years ago you may see them again and because you've had that one interaction or two or three year even years ago you're still going to feel comfortable to grab on her assets and she's she's gonna be okay with it because you both can read each other's energy and her energy is like let him grab it and his energy is like okay i'm gonna grab it and that's what happened in this interaction man but let me know what y'all think in the comment section below let me know your thoughts make sure you like this video and share it follow me on facebook twitter and instagram oh yeah i did a video about mary j blige and her divorce and how financially it, it almost ruined her because she had to pay alimony so go check that video out as well